Hi, welcome back to Joe Blogs. In today's video, I want to talk to you about a bizarre doodle that President Putin of Russia drew at a tech exhibition in Moscow recently, which has been analysed by an expert and reveals some really interesting things that are going on right now in terms of his temperament and his psyche. So before we get into that analysis, let's have a look at President Putin doing his amazing doodle. Now, nobody's entirely sure what the brief was for this doodle, whether he was actually asked to draw something specific or whether he was just given a free reign to design whatever he wants. But the initial takeaway is obviously that President Putin is no artist. This is not a work of art. And it's actually quite a bizarre drawing because although it's a picture of a face, the wiggly lines down the side and the strange hairline and the unusual expression give it a really odd look. And a leading graphologist and doodle expert, Tracy Trussell, has analysed the drawing in detail and provided a really interesting report as to what's going on currently with President Putin. Tracy Trussell is a world-renowned graphologist and her website states that doodles are the expression of subconscious feelings on paper, which she's able to decipher like maps and guide her exploration of the psyche. Her readings give a deep insight into the mind of the doodler, lucidly revealing character, thoughts and feelings. And Tracy Trussell believes that doodles tap into people's subconscious, releasing all of those repressed thoughts and emotions which come spilling out the back of our minds. In a statement, she said that doodling allows us to tune out and siphon off stress and tensions. It helps us to process difficult emotions. It is also deep thinking in disguise because it helps us to focus and clear our minds and potentially drum up light bulb moments like a brainstorming device. In terms of her overall assessment of President Putin's drawing, she claims that it exposes a paranoid, depressed and anxious leader. In terms of breaking down the doodle into its constituent parts, she says that the large right looking eyes give an insight into how Putin is already planning ahead. The big wide open eyes are observant and cautious. They are also about seeing and being seen, but they also symbolize a paranoia of being watched. Her analysis went on to say that the simple diagonal lines for eyebrows also represent power. Although the cartoon style of a smiling face gives an appearance of a man who is trying to convey congeniality and a sense of humor, someone who is determined to remain upbeat, someone who wants to come across as a people's person, someone who is warm, chatty and empathetic, the drawing's smile reveals a darker meaning. The smiling mouth has an angular smirk or tick in the corner, revealing his tenacity, which is now tinged with anxiety and impatience. In the bizarre SpongeBob looking sketch, Putin has incorporated random squiggles to frame the face. And Trussell believes that this represents how easily Putin's position can adapt and change because he's quick thinking and evasive. But at the same time, these lines also indicate signs of strain, tension and anxiety and suggest that Putin is struggling to cope and may potentially be starting to crack up. The wavy lines add to the messy nature of the drawing, which in itself tells us that Putin is feeling stressed and under pressure. She went on to reveal that as the head is facing straight ahead, this could signify a great deal in regards to President Putin's current mindset. The face is full frontal and quite large in size, revealing confidence and a self-centered, attention-seeking nature. This is all about who he is in terms of rank, dignity and prestige, and he's utterly egocentric and narcissistic. President Putin's cartoon uses red ink, which could reveal hidden secrets around his behavior. The use of a red pen is also significant and tells us how Putin is courageous and passionate about his cause and how he can be daring, impulsive and impatient. Along with these features, the graphologist highlighted that the hooked nose symbolizes persistence, determination and stubbornness and that the caricature can also conceal sadness and reveal how the doodler is trying to put a brave face on things. 
So this is quite an interesting piece of analysis. And the reason that I wanted to make this short video was really just to share with you some insight into what's going on in President Putin's mind at the moment. Whilst the 30 second doodle at a tech exhibition may seem completely irrelevant in the general scheme of what's going on in terms of the war in Ukraine, what I think today's analysis shows is that President Putin is clearly under pressure. He's got a lot of things going on right now and doodles apparently are a way of expressing our emotions subconsciously. Nobody is actively looking to tell a story when they make a doodle. It just happens because when you're releasing your creativity and trying to show people what you can do, all of those pent up emotions start to feed through. And what we've seen from today's analysis is that President Putin is clearly a confident, self-centered and determined individual. But underlying all of that, there is a lot of pressure and emotion starting to feed through. And he could potentially be starting to crack under the pressure of what's happening in Ukraine and the recent events with regards to the revolution by Wagner. So as I said, I wanted to post this video really because it's an interesting piece of analysis. It's a slightly different angle and also a little bit more lighthearted than some of the usual videos that I post. Hopefully you found it interesting, useful and slightly entertaining. If you've liked what I've said today, then please give me a thumbs up. Thank you for watching this video all the way through to the end. And here's something to put a smile on your face.